moon's phases, and the eclipses. The Earth orbits around the Sun, while the Moon orbits around the Earth. The animation shows the orbits as seen above the North Pole. In this animation, the Moon orbits Earth from a viewpoint above the North Pole. The blue grid lines show how the same side of the Moon always faces Earth. The moon keeps the same face to us, because it rotates at the same rate as its orbital motion, a special case of tidal locking called synchronous rotation. The moon's orbit is tilted about 5.1 degrees to Earth's orbit around the sun. The diagram at the right shows the moon as it revolves around the Earth, as seen from above the North Pole. Below is the side view. Sunlight illuminates half the Earth and half the moon at all times. But as the moon orbits around the Earth, at some points in its orbit the sunlit part of the moon can be seen from the Earth, and at other points, we can only see the parts of the moon that are in shadow. The dashed bracket lines indicate the portion or side of the moon that can be seen from Earth. As the bright parts of the moon appear to change shape during the month, each stage of the change is called a phase, and each phase carries its own name. The outer ring shows what we see on the Earth during each corresponding part of the moon's orbit. New Moon Waxing Crescent First Quarter Waxing Gibbous Full Moon Waning Gibbous Third Quarter Waning Crescent The orbital plane of the Moon is tilted about 5 degrees with respect to the Earth's orbital plane. The time period when the Moon, Earth and the Sun are lined up and on the same plane, allowing for the Moon to pass through Earth's shadow or the Moon to cast a shadow on Earth is called an eclipse season. Solar and lunar eclipses are special cases of the Moon phase. During the new Moon phase and when the Moon blocks the Sun or a part of it, is called a solar eclipse. During the full moon phase and when the Earth casts a shadow on the moon, it's called a lunar eclipse.